First tonight, dramatic video of a truck crashing right through the airport in Sarasota. Good evening, everyone. I'm Paul Legrome. And I'm Wendy Ryan. Thanks for joining us. I want you to take a closer look at the video behind me, which so many of you have been sharing today. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane has a closer look at the damage left behind and how airport officials are now saying it is a miracle no one was killed. Two vehicles actually inside baggage claim. We're not sure how he came in. That's dispatch sound from just after 2.50 a.m. It's referring to this shocking scene at the Sarasota Bradenton International Airport. This surveillance video shows the terrifying moments when that white truck crashed through a concrete wall over a baggage conveyor belt and then smashed into the national rental car desk. There were two individuals behind the, the counter at the time and luckily uh, the corner of that counter is poured concrete and it stopped the vehicle or it probably could have resulted in a couple fatalities. And it's believed the truck was going well over 100 miles per hour when it crashed through this wall at baggage claim. On the video, you'll see that he wasn't stepping on the brake when he came close to the wall. Law enforcement says it's a miracle no one was killed. The people behind the desk uninjured. Even the man who barely missed being hit in the head by this rock of concrete that went right through the O of the Alamo sign. The driver has been identified as 40-year-old Juan Monsivis. He was taken to the hospital with serious but non-life-threatening injuries. What caused the driver to crash is still under investigation. He was spotted allegedly driving recklessly on Highway 41 prior to the crash. Amazingly, the crash did not cause any delays or disruptions to flights. We're fully operational. We still have two other bag belts. As long as no one else decides to drive through, I'm sure we'll have this up and running as quickly as possible. In Sarasota, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.